This is the Skin Food Salmon Dark Circle Concealer Corrector Cream, and it comes in two shades, um, one and two. I have number two, Salmon Beige, and it's kind of one of those concealers that is supposed to be salmon colored, you know, like the peachy pink kind of color, and it's supposed to conceal your dark circles, and you're supposed to be able to layer it without it looking cakey because that's what it claims. And I have to say, this is one of the most moisturizing concealers I've ever used. Um, and one of the most full coverage, I feel. Um, I don't know if it's because of the color itself and how it corrects the colors of the whatever you're um, trying to cover or because of the coverage itself, but um, it's super uh, creamy. And the texture is very similar to this, the Dual Honey Concealer from Skin Food as well. I've gone through like three of these because I keep coming back. Either I don't, either I finish the whole thing or I like lose it or I like give it away to someone because I, but I keep buying it because I just love it so much and it's only like $7. It just does such a good job of covering um, my dark circles, which I often have trouble because the shape of my eyes just naturally, I'll have like a dark circle there and you'll see it no matter what like angle you'll be looking at me from, but the way it brightens, but also conceals the dark blue under my eyes, it just takes care of the problem instantly. And I can, if I feel like I need more, I just layer it. However, because it's so creamy, um, it does, you do run the risk of uh, it settling in fine lines. That's why I only put it in the blue area of the dark circle under my eyes. I noticed that um, it creases a little bit more if I powder it. It both conceals my uh, dark circles, but also leaves it, my under eye area really moisturized because I hate, I don't mean I'll put eye cream, but then I don't want to dry it out again by putting like powder on top. I do have natural like actual, not wrinkle lines, but actual lines under my eyes and it does settle into that. So um, at the last step of like when I'm finishing my makeup, I'll kind of run my fingers underneath my eyes to get all that sort of creasage out of the lines. And the thing that I have been using a lot for lately is actually concealing my facial blemishes. Um, because it says dark circle conceal, I assume like, oh, you can only use it on your dark circles. But I noticed that it's fantastic for covering spots because, you know, when you get a spot, it's usually really drying. Uh, if you put concealer on top, the concealer will dry down and look kind of patchy or cakey or like just dry. This, because it's so moisturizing, um, I can use it on top of, uh, like I'll do my whole base with like, like a cushion BB cream or a cushion foundation, and I'll just bounce this on top of like any spots that are red or any blemishes that I have, and it really takes care of it, and uh, it generally keeps it concealed for the whole day. It actually does smell kind of like salmon. I don't know if they use real salmon in this, because you know skin food be using food in their ingredients. So that's basically all I have to say. It has really good coverage. It's layerable without being cakey. It is super highly moisturizing. And I find that it doesn't really cake on your face. Um, you just have to be careful about uh, fine lines, making sure your under eyes are really well moisturized and uh, all that jazz. Thank you so much for watching. I'll leave the link down below to where you can purchase this. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.